Asanteni sana wananchi ama wakaji ya kaunti yetu ya Baringo. Kwanza ningependa kuwasalimia nyinyi nyote. Ikisema iko juu sana. Amujamboni. Hebu tusalimiane hewani jamani bwana asifiwe. Bwana asifiwe tena. Ningitambua itifaki zote kianzia governor kwa pili governor Stanley Kiptis na deputy wage wake pia nikitambua wale wote ambao walichaguliwa hivi majuzi kianza na deputy governor wangu ana Kimwok senator wetu mheshimiwa cheptumo women rep wetu mheshimiwa chamatia wabunge wetu waheshimiwa mheshimiwa makila mheshimiwa kamren mheshimiwa sirma mheshimiwa kamket na mheshimiwa kiborek na yule ambayo hajaweza kuja siku ya leo aliniambia ni waombe eh, msamaha mheshimiwa kandie pia nikitambua wale ambao tutafanya kazi na hawa viongozi wetu wa county speaker wetu MC, eh, speaker wetu ambaye hapo hapa na MCs wetu wote wale ambao tulikuwa na hawa hapo awali nikitambua viongozi wetu wa kanisa wale walituombea hapo awali all the bishops and all the religious leaders pia yeah, nikitambua CS wetu mpendwa CS Chelugu ambaye amekuwa akiongea wakati huu na wale wote ambao sijawatambua ladies and gentlemen mimi kwa siku ya leo niko na furaha kuongea mbele yenu kwa sababu umenitunuku jukumu ya maana ya kuwa kiongozi wenu si miaka tano ijayo it is indeed a momentous occasion and i am very honored and humbled to be standing before you knowing very well that this was made possible by the grace of the almighty god and your trust and the trust that you have bestowed on us as your leaders to be able to steer this county for the next five years. I will be failing if I don't thank my family, if I don't thank my wife, if I don't thank the team that went around with me to ask you people to give us your votes. I am entirely grateful to everyone that made this a success. To my colleagues, the politicians, the members of parliament, to the, uh, the MCAs, I really am eternally very grateful. To the county commissioner, the security team, the county commander, and all their team, the IEBC, Really, this election would not have been successful without your input. I want to say that I'm forever grateful. This is a historic day for the people of Baringo County. The county of great diversity. The place that every Kenyan lives in comfortably without being harassed. Notwithstanding the challenges that we have. I salute Governor Kiptis and his team for having brought Baringo from where we left in 2017 to where it is now. Thank you very much. And just for the simple fact that you have honored this day to come and say, Governor Cheboy, the people have decided, take over from now, and then the future will take care of itself. I wish you well.
Na tutauliza rais wetu William Samae Ruto ajue kwamba hata wewe uko na uwezo ya kusaidia sisi katika Kenya hii. Thank you very much. I was privileged, ladies and gentlemen, to have served you as your first governor during the onset of devolution. This was mainly a period where we started from zero, where we were laying foundations, where we started building this great county. There has been remarkable progress that was made from that time up to now. But the truth of the matter is, Bado Tukona Mbali Akwenda. We have a lot, to, a lot to do. Our young people need jobs. They are everywhere. Wakati tulikuwa naenda kuomba kura, kile wazazi walikuwa na uliza, ni kusema governor, mtarajiwa, tafadhali, tuondolea shida ya kuwa na watoto nyumbani. We have had problems. Our farmers need better returns for their produce. Wakulima wetu wanataka kusaidiwa waweze kuzalisha mali kuongezeka. Our hard working men and women in our markets want better services as they carry out their business. During the campaigns, I made promises. We made promises together with your other leaders. And I want to assure you that speaking on behalf of other leaders and speaking on behalf of myself, ile commitments about Tuluapatia, the commitments that we gave you, that we are going to work on our healthcare system, that we are going to make sure that water is available for you, that we are going to make sure that your wealth, you can be able to create more wealth for yourself, is the commitment that we stand to continue saying today. The county government has a clearly defined role to play in bringing solutions to these challenges we have. Kwe tuke baubari go hii, nikitembea kila mahali, unakuta watu wako na shida. Shida ya chakula, shida ya kazi, shida ya amani, na hayo yote. Nataka kusema sisi kama viongozi wenu. Tukiungana na senator, tukiungana na women rep, Tukiungana na wale watu wanafanya katika provincial administration, the county commissioner, the provincial administration, tukiungana na nini wananchi, we shall be able to deliver. It is not me alone who can take pride to be able to solve the problems of this county. I will be lying to you if I tell you that I will solve the problem alone. We need the presence of Moshimua William Ruto, the president of this republic, so that we can be able to deal with the challenges that we have. I can tell you, kila mtu wenu, hako na nafasi ya kufanya kitu, ya kuinua hali ya uchumi ya county hii. Hako na nafasi ya kutoa suluhu ya shida yetu katika county hii. Kama ni kuwenda kufanya kazi ya ukulima, Wewe ufanye kwa njia yote, kwa nguvu yako yote. Kwa sababu kulima yetu, itatuletea utajiri. Kama ni kazi ya kutunza kawa, ama kazi ya kutunza mifugo wetu, ama kazi ya kwa kwamba wamafanya kazi wananchi kwa njia mzuri. Kama wewe ni daktari, kama wewe ni veterinary officer, you have a role to play. We can do something about these challenges facing our people. As John Maxwell says, Everything rises and falls on leadership. The burden that you have bestowed on us, your leaders, you have bestowed on the MCAs, you have bestowed on the, on the MPs, you have bestowed on the senator, you have bestowed on the women rep, and more importantly, you have bestowed on His Excellency President William Samuel Ruto, is enormous. We have to work for you. We have to make sure that we deliver for you. Ladies and gentlemen, hapa ni nyumbani kwetu. Atuna nyumbani ingine ni jukumu yetu kwa kikisha kwamba sisi tunafanya kazi hapa. Tufanya kazi kwa nguvu. Tufanya kazi kwa upendo. Tufanya kazi kwa umoja. Ili watu wetu waweze kufaidika. 
my administration will tap into the potentials that the communities are blessed with, that our professionals, and there are many here, our businessmen, and there are many here, our young people, and they are all here. We must work together so that we can leverage on the opportunities that we have here. We know a hali maisha yetu katika county here. Ladies and gentlemen, during the campaigns, I kept hearing the people asking for better service delivery from our county government. I kept hearing the people saying there are no drugs in our hospitals. I kept hearing the people saying we need water in our homes. I kept hearing the people saying that we need money to pay school fees for our children. The constitution clearly outlines the roles and functions of the county government and those of the national government. Institutional building and strengthening will be critical in restoring public trust and confidence in the institutions rather than individuals. I do not want to think that an individual has a solution to our problems. It is the institutions that we have created. It is the members of the county, is the county assembly. It is our security department. It is those that are dealing with matters of ethics and anti-corruption. It is those that are dealing with matters of governance at all levels. We will work together with all those in those institutions to make sure that we can be able to deliver to our public. I will work closely with different partners to achieve this. The non-governmental organizations, the financial institutions, the national government, these are critical partners in this process. Ladies and gentlemen, with my team, together with my team, as we traverse every part of this county, we promised and committed to ensure that we will work tirelessly to make the lives of our population better during our term in office. Our message was on wealth creation. Wakikisha kwamba kila mtu wako na chakula yake, kila mtu anaweza kupata pesa ya kujinsaidia na ayo. Our message was delivering better quality lives for all our people. To achieve this, I will need all decks, on all hands on deck, to paraphrase His Excellency President William Samai Ruto. The support of all the people of the county, the national government, faith-based institutions, and other non-state actors is paramount. A former US president once said, ask not what America can do for you, uh, he said, ask not what America will do for you, but what together, CC Sote, what together we can do for America. I believe that CC Kama Wananchi went to Barigo County. To see Ulize, Barigo County ita kufanya nini. Nikidogo sana hile Barigo County ita kufanya. Lakini, tukifanya kazi pamoja. And I want to emphasize, kwa malazima tufanya kazi pamoja. Tutatembea kila sehemu county hii. Tutatembea TRT, tutatembea Baringo North, tutatembea Baringo South, tutatembea Lama Rafin, tutatembea Mogotio, kuwasiliana na nini, kujua ni shida gani ambayo tunataka kufanya. Tutafute suluhu pamoja. Our county is home to the lakes, uh, to three lakes like the famous Lake Bogoria, with the renowned hot springs and millions yearly cross continents and nations to witness this. There are discoveries that trace their roots to this county and to this date they remain untapped and underutilized. We were recently uh, declared to be a geopark by UNESCO. I believe that this has worked to enhance our tourism potential. This is an opportunity that we will tap in to impact the lives of our people better. Ladies and gentlemen, I do not want to tire you with a lot, but I am saying we are taking office at a time when youth unemployment, insecurity, poor infrastructure, low productivity, low private sector investment, and low capital remains our major challenges are facing the county. I commit, and I want to insist, I commit to provide leadership in addressing these challenges in an innovative manner and also building a conducive environment that will facilitate investors 
to complete, complete effectively with other counties. We have the opportunity of raising uh, the Baringo to be among the great or confine it to the territories that will follow other counties. We can be able to do that together. Ladies and gentlemen, we all can do something, each, each of us, at the family level, at the village level, at the location, at the constituency, and the county level. The farmer, the children in school, mothers and fathers have a place in this journey. And that is why we have commenced here today. I urge us to shift our mindset to productivity. Where we unaiza kuzalisha nini? Where we unaiza kutengeneza nini ambayo tunaiza kuhuza? Ili utajiri uje katika county yetu. Kama ni kuzalisha mifugo mzuri, tusalishe. Kama ni kuhakikisha kwamba kawa ina, ina, ina nawiri, tufanya hivo. Kama ni kupanda um, um, chai kule ya dema ravin, tufanya hivo. Mambo hayo yote, tutaweza kufanya pamoja, tuinue utajiri wa county yetu. Let us be proud to be a people who produce something for ourselves first and then have surplus for the market. My administration will establish and implement policies that will promote unity, cohesion, harmony, and opportunities for all to thrive in the county. Nimesikia hapo awadi wananchi wa kisema tuko na shida ya usalama. Na naamini kwamba raisi wetu mpendwa William Samae Ruto wakiwa pale, wabunge wetu hawa wakiwa hapa, Viongozi wa kanisa wakiwa hapa na viongozi wetu masisis wetu na MCS wetu tutamaliza hiyo shida na tukifanya kazi pamoja na security team and I want to th thank them and congratulate them for the work that they have done in the short time that they have been here we shall overcome this challenge of insecurity we commit to work closely with the county assembly the national government to ensure that the policy development and implementation is done in an harmonious manner so that resources are used efficiently for good of the people and thus achieve the greatest impact possible. Ladies and gentlemen, to tackle the perennial problems associated with security, we will work closely with the national government to ensure that the security system is well facilitated to carry out its mandate with the, within the county. We will take we will be able to work on these criminal elements and work to mitigate the causes of these crimes uh, innovatively. We will drastically reduce this crime throughout the county and my administration will achieve this by working closely with the people since they are the ones who benefit more from securities. Ladies and gentlemen, agriculture has been and still the bedrock of our economy and therefore my government will give the sector the highest priority. I tell you, our manifesto as UDA has said that the single most efficient way to increase the economy and to tweak the economy of this country is to invest in agriculture. We in the county will do that because we must feed our population. Nobody should go hungry. We must ensure that people produce what to eat and we will facilitate our people to be able to produce the food that they want. Most of the productive output from Baringo, milk, meat, honey, uh, is exported from the county in raw form. This means that we do not command most of the wealth in the value chain. And that is why during our first time we started the issue of processing milk. We have started the issue of processing meat. We have uh, started, we started the issue of processing leather. All these things, we're going to make sure that they come to pass to ensure that we will in, um, increase our value of our products. We will put in place mechanisms that will ensure that there is value addition for our produce uh, to be able to command the market in, 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 in its entirety. We will shift our agriculture and therefore our economy away from being rain-fed to water-fed through investments in water retention and irrigation. My government will invest, work, will invest and work closely with the national government, private sector and development partners to construct dams across the county. 
the water from these dams which shall be used for irrigation, generation of power, fish farming, greenhouse-based agriculture, and clean piped water for all households. Mambo ya maji bado yuko shida kwetu na naamini miaka 5 ijayo hii shida ya maji itaisha. Shida ya kukosefu wa chakula hatutakuwa naye. Shida ya kushindwa na kulipa fees itaisha. Shida ya kukosa dawa katika hospitali haitakuwepo. Hiyo maneno yote hiyo ni kazi ambayo mmetupatia mmetupatia kama wa, eh, viongozi wenu. Education is a key facilitator of development and today the human capital from our county have managed to compete effectively at the national and global levels because of their academic qualifications. This is an area that I am passionate about. We will support and support the development of talents. You saw today very good people in sports, very good in music, very good in culture. We shall be able to focus on the interests of these young people to ensure that our people are able to get the best, nothing but the best. I will support and support the development of these uh, sporting facilities. Somebody talked about the stadium. We will complete the stadium. We will work with the national government to build the best stadium. We will, we will ensure that our people, our young men, are able to, to use that stadium within the shortest period of time. Somebody talked about kingdom. I can tell you we are going to work with the national government, especially the president and the leaders that we have here, to ensure that kingdom performs its function. The area of Baringo Central and Baringo North must get sufficient water to effectively serve our people. Sure, sure. The El Ramarabin Chemususu uh, Water Project, the last mile must be done within this next year. We want to make sure that everyone all the way from Adamarabin to Mogotio and to those parts that shall get that water are provided with the water. Ladies and gentlemen, my administration will aggressively market the county as a tourism destination and ensure that Baringo is part of the circuit that connects Samburu, Masai Mara and the Western Circuit. We will also ensure that the locals take ownership and are part of these visiting sites. There is a new tourism activity called trekking, and uh, that is one of the things that we shall be investing in. Watu wakuja ubaringo kutembea kupanda milima na mabonde ili waone uzuri wa county yetu. We will ensure that county government dedicates efforts and energies to building and improving and maintaining their roads and the transport network. We will work with the national government to ensure that more tarmac roads, and I am going to request our members of parliament to work with us in this, to ensure that our roads are sufficient enough to make sure that we are able to travel from one end of the county to the other. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, a healthy population is very critical because they will have the energy to drive growth in the county. The people of the great county of Baringo have the right to the highest standard of health. I do not want and I do not want to see the situation that even one person can go to the hospital and not find treatment, and not find drug. I am committed to putting my experience and energies towards delivering this. Ladies and gentlemen, I am committed to provide leadership in the county governance as provided for by the devolved system to ensure that Baringo continues to develop. We will ensure that in our work, the people are consulted so that they can contribute to the growth of democracy, good governance, unity and cohesion within the county. Ladies and gentlemen, together I want to ensure that we have what it takes to confront any challenges that is ahead of us. I may not have all the ideas to get things moving, but I assure you, that I have the resolve and the commitment to listen, to consult, and to act upon good ideas that will get us forward. We shall involve the communities, we shall involve the professionals, we shall involve the leaders in tackling the challenges that face us. With the Lord's grace upon us, we can achieve a lot together. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. Our Shukuru Tena. Na kusema asante 
kwa viongozi wote ambao wamekuja kutusherekea na sisi na wale wote ambao wametuwezesha kupata kura za kura za kufanya sisi tukoe kama na wenyu na wale viongozi wote ambao mmekuwa nayo asanteni sana kwa sababu naona mvua inataka kuja na washukuru na wapenzi tunasema tuendelee kwa umoja na mapenzi Thank you very much and God bless you ladies and gentlemen. Asante asante sote tusimame ndio tupate maombi ya mwisho kisha tupate wimbo wa taifa. Reverend Julius Chepsat